All right, good morning po. Magandang umaga po sa inyo lahat. Uh, umagang umaga po. Nawawala uh, pala yung salamin ko. Uh, we're gonna talk about uh, Joshua Pulev and uh, the fight of uh, Anthony Joshua. It's uh, happening right now. We're watching it live. So, um, mic, mic check, mic check. See if I can watch it on my other desktop. Okay, magandang umaga po. Uh, pasya, uh, sa YouTube lang po tayo naka-live ngayon. So, umaga-umaga eh. I need my coffee. <laughs> I've exceeded my device limit. Okay, fine. I'm gonna watch it on my. Uh... Let me see how many devices I have. Okay, Anthony Joshua po at saka uh, Pulev ang um, pinapanood natin ngayon. I know it's early in the morning, uh, but uh, I want to react to this. I, I think this is going to be a short fight. And uh, we're just doing the live stream on, on YouTube, by the way. Okay, round number one is about to start. Can you guys hear me? Uh, okay, so round number one is starting right now. So uh, Anthony Joshua is wearing, wearing white and uh, Pulev is uh, wearing red trunks right here so again this is just round number one right now they're just looking at each other nothing much is happening yet this is just the very first round uh, of this fight uh, they have such great entrance coming in, both of them. It's such a great atmosphere. The Seven Nation Army song chanted by the, the fans. So um, Kubrat Pulev record is 20, 28 wins with only one defeat. And uh, of course, Anthony Joshua is a 23 win with only one defeat. The defeat of uh, Anthony Joshua came from Andy Ruiz back in uh, June of 2019 in New York, <clears throat> and he was able to get it back on, on the rematch uh, in uh, in Saudi Arabia. Uh, and now this is that uh, first fight after that uh, that that the rematch against Andy Ruiz. Now for Kubrat Pulev, um, he's a tough guy. 28 wins, only one defeat. Uh, he lost against Vladimir Klitschko. That was back in 2014. And uh, he is 39 years old uh, from Bulgaria. So I know you can see that uh, I look like I just woke up because I literally just woke up. It's, uh, I woke up about 6.30 a.m. here in the Philippines. And we're watching this. And, and uh, this fight is happening in, the, in UK at Wembley Arena in, in London. Okay, magandang umaga po sa mga Pilipino boxing fans na nanonood. Eh, very early in the morning, eh. 
I don't expect a lot of people watching uh, uh, for my followers. But then again, now maybe, oh, Anthony Pulib. Those are nice jabs coming in. You know, for, for heavyweights, uh, sometimes it's, uh, you know, even though Anthony Joshua is the heavy favorite here, uh, I look at the, the betting sides. Uh, heavyweights, anything could happen because of those heavy handed, uh, of heavy hands. And uh, round one is just uh, done. Um, and I think round one went to uh, Anthony Joshua. Good morning. I'm live streaming directly on uh, on YouTube. So if you're looking for the fight, you can't find it uh, find it uh, on YouTube definitely because of the copyright issue. Uh, but later t today, I will also be uh, live streaming uh, and, and doing a commentary on the. Uh, on the fight of uh, Felix Verdejo and Shakur Stevenson uh, and Berlanga, those are the, the three fighters that are expected to, to win uh, tonight. So every every uh, every boxers who are who are expected to to win one uh, on this card in UK. This is round number two. Uh, both of both fighters are careful actually. Uh, they the the trash talk. During the uh, the way in, they say respect, but uh, they've been trash talking, and they, they said they're gonna prove each other. There you go. Now they unloaded those heavy punches. Again, we're watching this on the zone. Uh, I'm I'm gonna actually uh, give you a link where to watch this live. Uh, let me just uh, get that for you. We are now at round number two. Nothing much is happening uh, for both fighters. Uh, good jab there by Joshua. This fight has... Uh, they're very careful. There you go. One, two, three, four, five. Combination punches and Pulip just smiled after Joshua. After those uh, combination punches by by Joshua. This is round number two. One minute and thirty one seconds left. Let me see if I can give you a link on the, where to watch this. Again, uh, th both but both fighters are just uh, jabbing. Uh, not a lot of uh, combination being thrown here. It was Joshua who threw uh, a five punch combination earlier. The referee looks really small there. Watch on the zone. Okay. Uh, <laughs> end of round number two. Uh, round number two is done. And I think it's still Anthony Joshua is winning the fight.
No one has been hurt so far. It's just two rounds. Uh, this is, again, the Anthony Joshua and the uh, Kubrat Pulev fight that, that's happening in, in the UK. Uh, Wembley Arena. This is for the WBA, IBF, WBO, and IBO uh, World Heavyweight Championship. The only uh, title that is missing here is the WBC. Round number three. They start in the middle once again. Uh, nothing much going on in the middle. They both fake each other. Uh, Kubra coming in with a jab. And they are now holding each other in the middle with the smile. The only uh, belt uh, that is not there is the belt held by Tyson Fury. Pulev coming in again. Joshua almost slipped there. Joshua said, uh, I mean, Pulev said uh, during the weekend, weigh in that I, I will show you. So let's see how, how far you can show. Three minutes, I'm sorry, three rounds uh, in the third round already, one minute and 40. Six seconds left in the third round. Um, if you don't know me, my name is Pau. I, I usually do local commentating. I'm not sure if Filipinos are going to be watching this, but this is the Anthony Joshua. Okay, Pulib is hurt here. And Anthony Joshua is going for it. Anthony Joshua unleashing left and right. And Pulib just smiled right there. But Anthony Joshua is not letting go. And he is pushing here, uppercut, hook after hook, uppercut after uppercut. Pulev looks still confident here. He was he's smiling, but he's not retaliating back with anything other than just a smile. Uh, and uppercut, those hit him. Those hit him again. Uppercut left and right. And, oh, he's turning back. Oh, that's not right. He's knocked out. Standing knocked out. Wow. Oh my goodness, Anthony Joshua, pepper, punches, and he is going for it. 44 seconds, he's going to try and end this in the third round. Uh, Pulev looks wobbly here, he's not re replying right back, he's getting pummeled right here. Uh-oh, he's down. Second time in the round, round number three. He's down. He, he is look bedazzled here. He is down. He is hurt. Again, this is the third round of the Anthony Joshua Kubrat Pulev fight. And the Anthony Joshua looks to finish in the third round after those onslaught of attacks, hooks, uppercut. And Kubrat Pulev could not take it. And wow, he's hugging now. He was smiling. Ooh, ooh, extracurricular activities right there after the referee said stop. Wow, what a third round and what a statement right there by Anthony Joshua. Let's look at the replay right here. Look at this, guys. Boom, go straight to the jaw. And let's see the other replay here. Pulev was looking confident as, as if he can take the punch, but not the punches. And those punches hurt him, and he is pummeled right here on the ropes. Joshua is not stopping. Joshua, he said uh, he was trained to, to kill here. He was trained to destroy. And there, there you go. Just like a uh, pepper of punches here. And Anthony Joshua looks hyped. And Anthony Joshua looks like he wants to really finish the bout in this round. My name is Powell. Thank you very much. And this is the uh, Anthony Joshua versus Kubrat Pulev fight blog and commentary. Round number four is starting. I'm watching on the zone. I know it's very early. I know that uh, I don't expect anyone to watch. But uh, hey, I, I want to just bring you the news. Okay, Joshua, what, what a great round in the, in the last round, the third round. This is the fourth round. 
And Joshua starting with the jabs right away. I should uh, knock down twice. Kubrat Pulev has been down twice, ladies and gentlemen. Again, Kubrat Pulev uh, has been knocked down twice in this fight. One is a standing eight count, and the other is a, a full pledge knockdown. He just couldn't take it. Non stop attack. I thought Joshua was just going to go for it. Uh, hopefully he doesn't gas out. Is that what, ha what happened uh, during the uh, Anthony Joshua fight? And anything could happen here. If, uh, what happened here is he allowed Pulev to recover. And uh, Pulev, you know, a heavy guy and uh, who has the 21, I'm sorry, 14 knockouts out of 28. You know, that's still a capable hand right there. Thank you very much for all the likes and the share. Uh, unfortunately, uh, I can't show you uh, the real fight because it's not allowed. But I am allowed to let, let you know of what's happening. Uh, this is round number four. And this is uh, the Kubrat Pulev Anthony Joshua fight. Uh, World Heavyweight Championship. All the belts excluded the WBC of Tyson Fury. And I think after this one, it would be that fight for the unification. Now, the IBO championship is not really recognized, at least not yet, as the uh, a major title. So it's a secondary title. Cobra Pulev with the smile, the smirk on his face, except to say, ma'am, I'm still okay. I'm still here. I, I'm still fighting you. And round number four is over. So far, I haven't given any rounds to uh, Pulev. I thought it's going to end in a knockout. It did. It's, it's not yet done, however. This is just round number four. Round number five is about to start. Good morning, uh, Benjamin Logro, Sir Pao, watching from Paranaque. You know what I want to do um, on my Sir Pao channel, the Sir Pao Salute channel? I, I want to just do a, a morning live stream about uh, whatever is trend, a trending topic and just want to react to it. Uh, but right now, I, I am uh, commentating and reacting on the Anthony Joshua versus uh, Kubrat Pulev fight. I say a must-win fight for both fighters. Of course, especially for Anthony Joshua if you want to maintain uh, and uh, get that uh, push for the Tyson Fury fight, all British fight. And I'm sure the Brits are proud that because they, they got all the belts uh, in the heavyweight division. Kobrat Pulev, now the one uh, attacking here, inching closer, using that jabs. And that jab, he he is a, a bit smaller here at 6'4", compared to Anthony Joshua, who's 6'6". Six, six. Jab, jabs once again, that starts, everything starts with a jab. Taking, Kubra looks like he's trying to uh, gonna try an attack here, but it ended in the in a clinch.
so far in the fourth rounds, it's it's boxing. So just jabbing, jabbing each other. Joshua jabbing, Pulib jabbing. No one uh, committing anything yet to a combination. One, two, punch. There you go. And Joshua is again attacking here. But he had hugged. Good morning. So, um, I don't know why I'm speaking in English, but the Anthony, jo <laughs> Anthony Joshua, round number 5, 43 seconds left. Uh, wala pang... Uh, Wala pang nananalo. Of course, the round number three, baksak na dalawang beses po itong si uh, Kubrat Pulev. Uh, yun yung uh, time na talagang uh, binudbud ng suntok ni Joshua. Joshua is talking right now. Tsaka tumalikod itong si Pulev uh, in round number three just to, to get away from those punches. Thrown by Anthony Joshua, but Pulib looks to attack right here. And that is it. Um, a, a little bit of insignificant round. Uh, just Anthony Joshua winning again each and every round. His taller is bigger in that reach, and that's straight still. So landing its mark, boom, there you go to the jaw. But Pulev wasn't that affected this time. That uppercut, he misses that. The jabs, it's all Joshua. All Joshua, nothing much happening. The only thing that's working for Pulev here is that at least he's able to take the punches now. Round number three, he was down. And he was down not just one, but twice. Well, the first one, was was wasn't technically he, he wasn't technically down, uh, but he was counted uh, because he couldn't retaliate right back. He couldn't respond right back with those attacks, with those uh, bombard of attack from Anthony Joshua. Round number six. Here we go. Halfway mark. This is uh, of course scheduled for twelve rounds. Um, most heavyweights or most championship are. Wearing red for Pulev, and there you go with Anthony Joshua countering with a straight, but he wasn't able to hit the mark. Pulev now the one attacking, one, two punches, did not hit the mark. He's striking here. Trying to blitz forward here, Pulev. Nothing here. Jab, jab. So, um, uh, I, I would, um, uh, actually, if I was Joshua, I, I was successful when I, when I attack, but he's being reactive right here. Uh, he's letting Pulev di dictate the offense here. He's not doing anything. But Pulev is the one, you know, trying to pound and, and uh, attack. Joshua just uh, defending. Let me get my coffee because I need to wake up. <laughs> you know, heavyweight in the past... Uh, let me just tell you this heavyweight in the past, like uh, except for the Klitschko era, it, they they say that uh, it wasn't that good compared to the to the Tyson era, Ali era. Uh, hopefully, uh, these guys, the the Joshua, the uh, Tyson Fury, it's good. Hopefully, they could get back the the charm of the heavyweights uh, 
internationally. I'm sure in, in the UK, you know, it's a big deal because those are their fighters or in the in Europe. But man, they, they need to do a little bit more. <clears throat> Joshua's uh, stamina looks okay though. Paikot ikot siya dito. I want to know, uh, ask ko lang po yung mga nanonood, uh, 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 mayro, is, are there any foreigner watching or puro Pilipino? Pag mga Pilipino po, itatagalog ko na lang para mas maintindihan nyo kung ano nangyayari. If you're a Filipino watching this, it's just 27 of you on YouTube. Pakis, uh, comment naman, Filipino. Para malaman ko kung Filipino lang yung nanonood. If, if not, if you're not Filipino, or if there are any foreigners watching this one, if you can comment, uh, as well, so I can continue to speak in English uh, so that everyone can understand. So, pahi comment lampo. Later today, yeah, I'll be doing the, um, the Shakur Stevenson uh, Clary fight. So watch out for that. That's going to be at 10 a.m. And then uh, at, at night, we, we always do. Oh, I couldn't see the comments right here on my live chat. This is live round number seven fight Anthony Joshua versus Kubrat Pulev. There's something wrong on my live chat here. Okay, there's something wrong with my live chat. It was just it's just Benjamin and after Benjamin no one's commenting. Please comment. Wala pa pong nananalo. How do I fix this one? Well, welcome to the, remember the community guidelines. Round number 7. Okay, let me read it from the other. Okay. Um, David Ramirez, live na boss. Yes, live. Round number seven, uh, Anthony Joshua. Wala pang nananalo, Kimbo Slice, AAR2 TV. Two months subscriber. Thank you very much. Uh, sayo? Good morning, Sir Pao. Shout out watching here in Qatar. Good morning. Uh, very morning. Very early morning here. John, Sean, morning po, Kuya Pao. Cash out, out po. Uh, heavyweight ito. Naisipan ko lang pagkagising ko. Ay, nako. Be oh my goodness! Good uppercut right there by uh, Anthony Joshua and Kubrat Pulev just smiled again. Jonathan Lota Paul Blog. Good morning, Sir Pao. Salamat po sa mga nanonood. <clears throat> nag ano ko head kasi oh ang gulo ng buhok ko round number 7 final minute i'm watching it on the zone app uh so it's 149 if you want to watch it too under the zone app uh just click on the link uh that i provided it's 149 pesos you get to watch all the zone and uh, ang maganda dito walang lag talagang wali now tapos hindi ka pahanap hanap legal pa legit So, sabi, nag-minic message na sa akin eh, dito sa, sa group chat natin eh. Napaboard daw si ano eh. <laughs> Tingnan mo akong uh, gising ito si, uh, si Sir Kamao. Na uh, Kamao TV. Ay, sa Sports PH pala yung nag ano. Tapos na ang round number seven. Um, okay, now we're here. We go. You're, you're watching me here in the Philippines. Uh, I mean, you can watch it on the zone uh, if you want to watch the uh, the full fights. Because uh, as you know, in, in YouTube we can't really show that. So we have people watching uh, uh, outside the Philippines and wanted to request English. I'm looking at the replay. The uppercuts is, uh, are lethal for Anthony Joshua. 
that has been hitting the mark and that uppercut twice in round number seven. Pulev uh, successful with some uh, straight punches, but not enough to really hurt Anthony Joshua. We're going to round number eight. CM Fishing, English, bro. Shout out General Tino Nueva Isia. A shout out po sa mga taga Anu San Jose Batangas. Uh, Alden Mucklin from England. I love England. Here we go. Round number eight, scheduled for 12. Uh, Anthony Joshua in uh, Pulev, Kubrat Pulev. Okay, so um, if you're if you just came in here, um, Anthony Joshua was able to put down Kubrat Pulev twice in the third round, and uh, the first one was uh, well, let me just say this. Um, uh, let me rephrase that. Counted uh, down in the first time, it was a standing eight count. Uh, Kubrat Pulev turned his back. After uh, an onslaught of attacks, and then the, the second one was a real knockdown where he was just, uh, you know, he, I, I couldn't say gassed out, but just uh, couldn't take the punches and had to go down. This is round number eight. Kubrat Pulev looks like he found the second win here, attacking with those jab, uh, Anthony Joshua, replying with the uppercuts. Uppercuts has, was really amazing, hitting the mark and hitting it. Uh, consistently. Kubrat Pulev headhunting here. Going forward. Alden McLean, England. Yeah, what's up? Thank you for all the comments, guys. Salamat po. Salamat in Philippines. If you're not yet subscribed, and if you want to learn more about Filipino boxing, uh, although some uh, a lot of my contents are in Filipino, but you get to watch some Filipino fighters. I, I have a uh, live fights. I'm gonna show you later. Or I'm gonna let you know later. This is round number eight. One minute and twenty seconds left, and so far, it's all Anthony Joshua. Maybe round number eight, though, we can give uh, a little bit of edge uh, for uh, for Pulev. But uh, it, it's still one minute left. And uh, it's, it's just not showing enough here. It's not doing enough to, I think, kind of win the round. And every time he does, uh, Anthony Joshua uh, is able to counter him with, with, with the uppercut. The uppercut is really the icing on the cake. After that right hook, the uppercut just really it, perfect. That's all I can say. I mean, it, it looks really perfect going in. So uh, maybe I have Filipino fans watching uh, in England or English in in England. <laughs> Hello, mate. How are you doing? This is the round number eight. Fifteen seconds left. I uh, wasn't expecting this to be. Um, to reach round number eight after that third round, twice knocked down of Pulev, but he is still here. He is still in the fight. Uh, but of course, before the fight, uh, I know that uh, Pulev is a tough guy. Well, you know, without even looking at the at the um, at his highlights, of, although I've seen them. If you look at the record, the only defeat against Vladimir Klitschko, and he has not been down, and he had some tough fights right there so you would expect that he could stand up and again that loss was wasn't even uh, a knockdown so if there's anyone who's gonna be who could be knocked down or knocked out here based on his history or based on their records uh it, it may be anthony joshua because of what happened to andy ruiz so let me just tell you this. This fight is not yet over. It's far from over. And I think as long, let me say this, as long as Kubrat Pulev let go of that hand, uh, he has every chance to win this one. I mean, um, Anthony Joshua can be knockout. Can be knockout. And uh, Andy Ruiz have shown that. Uh, but again, uh, Anthony Joshua said that he is a different guy. In there, 
he was a different guy round number three round number uh, after that then it, it was all careful again and Pulev is the one just uh, attacking here what do you expect in this fight uh, for those that are watching I'm sure you're the, the hardcore fan of heavyweight boxing of Anthony Joshua maybe but what did you expect? We are now at round number nine, scheduled for 12. So this is in basketball in the Philippines because we love basketball. Um, this is the fourth quarter. So this is that quarter that Pulev needs to win. Well, let me, let me rephrase that. In basketball, you can catch up until the time is over. But this one, this is a lead that can't be caught. You know, you can't caught up, catch this one. You have to uh, go for a knockdown. Uh, if you're depending on the score... Uh, it's not going to happen right now. I, I get, again, at least on my scorecard. But, uh, you know, boxing, <laughs> it's, it's very subjective on who wins and whatnot. Um, there you go. Chris Mannix scored it uh, 10, uh, except for round number 8. So 79-71, 79-71. Wow. He, get, he scored the third round, 10-7. And the uppercut, 3-4. Uppercut. I don't know what's, what's going on with uh, Pulev just accepting. And he's not really moving after that uppercut. He's just blocking it like this. And it's still going in because, I mean, that's what it meant. The uppercut is meant to go in with a defense like that, right? You have to put down your, your arms. Round number nine, 47 seconds, 46 se seconds left. Anthony Joshua, magnificent showing so far. Very uppercut, those uppercut uh, and the uppercut just unleashed right there. And now Pulip is down. Now he's truly hurt. 28 seconds, now he's dizzy and looks like this is going to end. I hope Joshua attacks right here. Because he has a, a golden chance right here to end this one. Boom! And he is down. He's trying to go up. That straight punch. I don't know if he can get up. No, no, he's not getting up. He's not getting up. And it is over. Round number nine. Man, Anthony Joshua, what a straight punch. Congratulations. And he bowed down to the crowd. What an excellent showing. Anthony Joshua wins this bout. Wow. Man. What can I say? What can I say? I mean, Pulev. Pulev was, is knocked down. Knocked out. For the very first time in his career in round number nine. Anthony Joshua looks great right here. He played this systematically. He played this the right way. That's all I can say. Just walking down to the crowd. And Floyd Mayweather is in the crowd watching. Wow. This guy is really something. Floyd Mayweather in the crowd. <laughs> They're talking. You know, Floyd Mayweather. Wherever he is, he was making noise. Really something. Really something. Anthony Joshua hasn't been declared uh, the winner, but uh, we can talk about it. Um, on this one. Let's talk about Anthony Joshua. Um, here it is. Let me look at the replay once again. The jab, the uppercuts. Man, perfect. Perfect execution. And he, he's, it's not just one uppercut. Oh, there we go. That was not a knockdown. <laughs> he, he wrestled him. The uppercut, man. Man. Full swing, as in from, from, it came from down under. That uppercut, that would really hurt you. 
And on the side, another uppercut. Wow. Beautiful. Beautiful uppercut. Beautiful, man. And that has been landing all night long. The uppercut has been landing all night long. And he is down. And this is the, the last one. With I think that the straight punch ended it. Boom! Straight to the jaw. And pull it. Boom! Oh, my goodness. And just like a skyscraper falling down from the ground, he hits the canvas, lying down and looking tired and looking defeated. He can't get up from that punch. Look at his face. Three times being shown here on the Zone app. You can subscribe from the Philippines, 149 pesos. And uh, wow. It is something. Now they're talking. Okay, they look okay. They look okay. Now there's a talk of Tyson Fury here. Um, what did you think of the fight? So it ended... Um, with the knockout from Anthony Joshua. Did I bet? Uh, let me see my bet. <laughs> How did I bet this one? Anthony Joshua, we're just waiting for the final decision here, and uh, let's talk about what happened on the fight after. Anthony Joshua, AJ wins this one via knockout in round number nine. And uh, let's go ahead and talk about the, the fight. Right? This would be, um, I, I don't know how to say it, but uh, wow. I won $20. 7 to 12. Nice. <laughs> very nice Anthony Joshua I'm very happy with that okay thank you very much um, any comments here this is not pulling up uh... okay so let me let me talk to you real quick before I end this one um, so um, here's what I saw on Anthony Joshua, and I'm, I'm just gonna I'm, I'm gonna kind of create a, a separate video on this one. I think Anthony Joshua really improved in a lot of in a lot of ways. Very very still heavy handed, uh, so he got that uh, heavy hand in there still. I mean, 21 knockouts or 22 knockouts right now out of 23 wins, and he showed it tonight that he still got that power. What other things that he showed tonight is that. Uh, you know, he's careful, he's not rushing out things, and uh, he systematically uh, beat uh, Pulev right here with, there with, uh, with those uppercuts. Those uppercuts, those lethal uppercuts really started everything. Dizzied up uh, um, Pulev. Uh, Pulev just couldn't get back and couldn't uh, get away from those uppercuts. And uh, although a straight right hand finishes the Pulev, but... Uh, I think uh, the uppercuts really uh, did the, the damage right there. Uh, and uh, just Joshua uh, finishing up with a straight. He's being interviewed right here. Let's make some noise.
let me just listen in. Okay, it's not only my fight, uh, London fight, he said, AJ looks happy with his performance. I just want to pass. I appreciate the hard work. Eddie Hearn is here. Undisputed. Now there's a talk on up. I'm up for anything. Yeah, Tyson Fury, 2021. Okay, uh, Anthony Joshua just won right here, round number nine. So, guys, I'm just looking at watching the the post fight interview, but looks like uh, Anthony Joshua. Good morning, Satanan. Uh, Cotus review. Oh, and medyo may problema talaga yung ano, yung aking uh, comments. Hindi lumalabas lahat eh. Good evening from England. Uh, enjoying the commentary. Thank you very much. Thanks uh, for this, pal. Morning. Dito naman ako sa vlog mo noon sa live mo. A shout out from Puerto Princesa Palawan. Kala ko hindi mo i-cover. Kala ko rin eh. Dito mo sa YouTube lang tapos uh, nag-copy ako. Sabi ko, panoodin ko na. Sayang. Sayang din yung The Zone uh, app na dinownload ko eh. If you want to get the The Zone app, uh, oh, maybe I'll just add it on the link. I haven't really added it. Um, I'm partner with the uh, affiliate partner with uh, The Zone here in the Philippines. Uh, uh, so if you buy it legally, we can all watch at the same time. And you can just watch me on YouTube for commentary if you have two devices. If not, then you can just watch the fight legally without any delays, without uh um any issues like it's going down you have to look for other uh so yun okay so mukhang tapos na to and uh i have a busy day ahead of me i still have a lot of edits to do and uh again i i am uh, watching it on the zone app so please do get the the zone app so you can legally watch all of the fights of uh, the zone and uh Again, um, Anime Girl, good morning. Satanan, watching from Dios Bowl. Mat uh, matanda na si Pulib. Yeah. Okay, that ends our, our broadcast uh, for right now. Uh, we'll be back on the uh, Stevenson fight maybe around 10 o'clock. Okay, let me just get my breakfast. And uh, I, ha I had my coffee. Salamat po sa inyo lahat. And until next time.